So let's go to Open Office. If I double click, I'm going to choose the drawing module here. And I'm just going to uh, resize this a bit. Okay, and we also need our file folder open where the clipboard is, so I'm going to open that here and set it right next to it. Okay, so now it's just a matter of dragging and dropping our clipboard onto our drawing area. So the first thing I'm going to drag over is these uh, bells and I'm not going to keep them there. I'm just going to drag drag those over so that I can show you the difference between the uh, PNG and the JPEG. So I'm going to uh, right click, copy, right click, paste. You can also use control V and control C for your copy commands. Okay, I need to flip this so I'm going to right click, come down to flip, flip horizontally. Okay, now I'm going to drag my holiday greetings over here. And notice when I put the holiday greetings up here, you can see the holiday greetings overlays the top of the Christmas ornaments here. However, if we bring the Christmas ornaments to the front, which I'm going to do if I right click, arrange, and I'm going to bring it to the front. Now watch what happens when I drag my holiday greetings up here. My holiday greeting is in front of this ornament, so it shows through. However, on this side, since this is a JPEG image, it does not show through because the background here is white. Okay, so let's get rid of the ornaments. I'm going to hit the delete key. I'm going to click on it, highlight it, hit the, de hit the delete key. Okay, so now I'm going to, I'm going to resize the holiday greetings by left clicking, holding down the mouse, and then dragging the mouse to resize. Alright, so we want our uh, our holly up at the top, so I'm going to bring that in. And again, we need to resize that. Click and hold the left button and drag the corner in. Okay, now we've resized our holly. Actually, it's a little out of proportion. I'm going to resize it back down again. That looks better. Okay, so we're going to move this up into the corner. However, that's not quite right, so we need to flip that again. So I'm going to right-click, flip this time vertically. And that's pretty good, but I need to rotate that a little bit. So if I click on this again, you notice we have the green handles up here. That's for resizing. If I click again, we get the orange handles and you can see when I hover over one of the orange handles I get the little circle that says rotate so now if I hold down my left button again and drag the mouse I can rotate this image and now it fits in the corner I like that a lot okay now you can't do that if you're using writer you can drag the image in and you can resize it but you cannot rotate it so that's why I like the draw module. So if I right click, copy, right click, paste, now I can drag this copy over here. And again, we need to flip it. So I do a right click, flip horizontally, and now I can put that up in the corner. Okay, so all I need to do now is put some holiday garland down at the bottom so I'm going to right click hold I'm sorry I'm going to left click hold that button down and drag this image over 
and we need to resize this so I am gonna we notice we're in the rotate so if I click on it we're going to go back into the resize and I'm going to resize our garland that looks about right so if I do a copy and I do a paste I have another one okay if I do a paste again I have a third and now I can put our garland down here at the bottom and that looks pretty good so now all I need to do is save that and in order to uh, save it as a PDF file we actually have to use the export function export as PDF and we can leave this as all we can check lossless compression and simply click export alright and let's go ahead and let's put that in the same folder we were using before which is the pictures and state and um, my pictures clip art and we'll save okay so do we have it there let's take a look and there is our PDF file I forgot to title it but that's okay you can put the proper title in it so if I close our open office draw and I don't need to I'm just going to discard this because we have our PDF file and if I double click on the PDF it brings it up in Adobe Reader and uh, you can see the stationary now let's resize that to um, I think it was 75 percent there we go and you can see the completed stationary so you can have fun doing that I'm not gonna go over cr uh, creating it in the um, in the writer module I am assuming that most people know how to use a word processor and drag the images in and move them around so thank you for watching